It may be Friday the 13th, but the North Dakota hockey team is hoping it's their lucky day on their home ice. They return to conference action tonight. Valley News Live sports reporter Jack Wallace joins us live from the Ralph Engelstad Arena ahead of this NCHC series. Jack, you ready for a big game tonight? Well, that's right, Devin. We have fans packing into the Ralph all around me. They're getting excited to see UND taking on this Western Michigan team. That's one of the top scoring teams in all of the NCHC. It's going to have a lot of offense tonight, at least we're thinking so far. But UND has been on a little bit of a hot streak recently. They had two straight wins over Lindenwood in this barn, and that was right after the end of the sort of first half of the season where they took care of Western Michigan, drawing in the first game, winning the shootout, and then taking the next game on the rope. We spoke with some of the team and the players this week a little bit about what it means to have such a big NCHC game coming back here at home and how that means to go up against one of the top offenses. Yeah, um, obviously it's a tough place to play in Lawson. It's always fun, uh -huh. but, uh, you know, we know what we did when we went in there, and we know they're going to be hungry coming in here, so it's uh, going to be a battle. They're feeling good offensively. They, they've scored eight goals against Ferris, eight goals against Michigan Tech, and, you know, Poland's, I think, had a hat trick in both games. So it's, you know, we got to make sure we identify those players that are on the ice and do a good job of defending against them. Now, one of the top players to watch for tonight is going to be Tyler Clevin. He had one goal in his first 18 games so far this season, and then two in each of his last two games. He has been on a hot streak, and it's going to seem pretty exciting if he can continue that into this game and perhaps into the series and the rest of the season. With the UND hockey team, Jack Wallace, Valley News Live Sports. Thanks, Jack. Go get some concession food before the puck drops. UND has won their last three games, four if you include that exhibition contest against the U.S. under-18 team. They look to extend that streak and gain some ground in the state.